Hello there internet dwellers, welcome to another reaction video. Today I'm going to be reacting to No Sleep, the video edition. Uh, it's a Reddit subreddit. No Sleep is where you usually put like these true horror stories or creepy stuff that's happened to you, creepy pastors, stuff like that. Uh, it's where I got most of my stuff for Creep Source from. But I would love to get back into Creep Source if I could, but obviously YouTube prefers people hanging in woods than creepy little stories that probably aren't true so anyway so we're gonna do this we're gonna get straight into this i've selected a couple of short ones because most of these are pretty long we're gonna get started on this one called mama which is loaded here let's put this in full screen and uh let's do this okay turn this up a bit there we go okay so it's a little girl sleeping okay i'm gonna do a running commentary of what i see okay doors opened very disturbing girl walking backwards with a doll in her hand. Where is that? You know why that scared me? Oh god, it's foreign as well. You know it's going to be freaking. That's not foreign. To me, it's foreign. To you, it's probably not. To you, I'm probably foreign. So, what did she say? Hang on, let me go back. She said, We have to go, let's go. Okay, so we have to go. There's no explanation of why they have to go. She takes her fish bowl with her. Okay. Okay, so they're about to go down the stairs. Very eerie looking. This reminds me of that, um, um, Amityville Horror or whatever it's called. Winding staircases are never good. I really like the cinematography. Oh, I like the soundtrack, how it's kind of going... It's, it's mirroring what they're doing. That's pretty good. Why is it so... Victoria, no mires! Vamos! Victoria! What? No! Oh my god! Holy crap! Holy crap! Go give your mama a hug. Oh no! Hell no! Hell no! I would be... I would either smack her really hard in the face or run like these girls are doing. That sly... That is sly. Just locked her sister out. Is gonna come running around the, co the corner? Or is it gonna. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, this is really well made. Holy crap. That was really good. Okay, so the next one is See You Soon. Uh, just from the actress alone, I can tell that this is the same guy who made Lights Out. It's that uh, short film where, what's it, you turn the lights off and then something appears down the hallway and then you turn it on. So you have to keep the lights on. But this is 13 seconds long, so here we go. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really Polaroid. Oh god, it's just gonna be like a ghost capture. It's like that Project Zero game. He captured ghosts through the camera. I bet there's gonna be someone sat on that seat. Oh, how no. Is he too afraid to look up? I'd be up, yeah. Why is there a light on the chair like that? I bet it's gonna be really up close to him this time. Holy crap. Oh God. What would you do? What would I do? You can't exactly call the police, could you? I think it was a hoax. I love how calm this guy is. I'd literally be farting right now. Sharting, more like. And he walks towards it, of course he does. This is why, kids, you 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 don't you just don't follow what people do in horrors, okay? Because they just get themselves killed. Oh god, it's going to be really up close, you stupid idiot. Or it's going to be behind him. 
He's going to take the picture. There's going to be nothing there. And it's going to be behind him. Guaranteed. I knew it. Oh! <laughs> wow. Okay. Jesus. Wait, that was a, the monster was played by Kevin. He actually looks like that, guys. Okay, one last dive. This one's one minute, eight seconds long. These are like short horror films, I guess. Listen up, boys. Chief wants us to wrap this up in 20. Repeat. We got okay. that time. One last dive. So it's a POV right. horror. It's like found footage, but it's from his perspective. Unless there's an actual camera on his... It's a bike. No time he's gonna find like a kid in there or something. I don't think this is underwater at all. I think it's it's made to look like it's underwater. Yeah, they've just added in the particle effects around the light. <laughs> Maybe it is underwater. Oh, man, he's chained up. Oh, man. That is proper horrifying. Now he's stuck under there. He can't get out. This one's called Santa. It's a short Christmas horror. So, um, post-Christmas, but still. What if the fire was on? He like burn his bum. This doesn't feel like a horror so far. I mean, it's got the girl in a white dress, a white dressing gown, which is always horrifying. Oh, hell no. Why would he not check around the corner? Like, why would he not? These poor kids. And wasn't there... Oh dear. I swear there was a um, an old folk tale about um, the Christmas devil. It was about a guy who, if you was a bad boy slash girl, he would come and abduct you. Maybe that's what that was about. Coffer, short horror film. Is this the same director as... Yeah, it is. This guy's a brilliant director. Because this film was actually made into a proper like feature film. That lights out anyway. Yeah, just go g g casually check it out. Then again, it could be like a rat or something. Wow. Yeah, definitely move house. Or just like duct tape it shut. Bit of blue tack. Blue tack's not going to hold it, but still. Get blue tack and you'll be sound. What the hell? You just let it out. Are you crazy? These guys need to get their floorboards checked out. It's proper squeaky. Or creaky, not squeaky. <laughs> Casual. A chest that leads into the abyss. No, not the marble. That's an expensive marble. Oh no, was there a baby down there? Someone's got some bad mothering skills.
Jesus. Oh my god. Literally, the thing is, that guy makes all of it. Literally, it's just him that does it. This video may as well be dedicated to this dude because he does the best short horrors I've ever seen on the internet. Why would you have that portrait in your house? Or that, what is it? Would it be considered portrait? I mean, it is portrait. Oh. Wait, where did that photo go? Wouldn't this girl just move house by this point? She's She's got a, a demon that comes and attacks her when the lights are off. She's got a, a demon inside a chest. And she's just got demons in her hand. And she's got a woman inside a, a portrait that seems to be alive all the time. Holy crap. Yeah, I think nothing of it. it. Must have been the wind. Jesus. Oh boy, oh boy. She's escaped. She's inside the house. I genuinely scared the children. I don't know if you guys, if you guys can't see that. I said, hammer, you, hammer yourself. demon that lives inside a photograph. It's an original idea, I'll give her that. Kind of like the ring, but in picture form. Oh god, no. I said, look away. Oh, she's turning round. Oh, that's so good. Reminds me of like a Japanese horror. Stop doing that! Oh, hell no. Hell no. No, don't do it again! Just put masking tape over her face! You absolute idiot. Oh my god, that was incredible. That was incredible. Are you seriously Instagramming that? Oh, the apple's gone. You're definitely going insane, love. <laughs> She's a murderer. Hell no! This house has seen many things. Oh no. Such original ideas, man. Gotta say that. Gotta give credit where it's due. Maybe someone on the bed, isn't there? Like, hogtied and gagged. These ghosts are into some kinky stuff. Just put the phone away. If it only exists in the the Okay, it doesn't exist in the uh phone world. That was uh you know what I think it's best to leave it there, guys. That was there were some pretty damn good videos, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, if you guys did enjoy this reaction video and would like to see me react to even more short horrors there are plenty out there on youtube so there we go guys hopefully you did enjoy if you did be sure to leave a like rating down below if you're new to the channel want to subscribe for more reaction videos thank you guys for watching see you later